Hey you guys, it's me Spongebob number one fan 2003 here and happy Valentine's Day! So yep, today it is Valentine's Day and I actually got quite a bit of awesome stuff from my mom today. So let's go ahead and get started with this Valentine's Day haul. Okay, so to start off my Valentine's Day haul, I got this super adorable Spongebob t-shirt. And I absolutely adore this t-shirt. I really, really adore the Pest of the West episode. I think it's very, very super good. Okay, so as you can see, it's this very, very nice black color right here. And it has adorable little Spongebob with kind of a angry, determined face. And there's some cactuses right here. One there, and then one here. And then there's a little starfish right here, too. And it says, little dude with attitude on it, because Spongebob is a little dude with an attitude. <laughs> and, um, yeah, it's pretty, you know, plain on the back side, but I absolutely love this shirt. I really, really super adore it. Okay, so that's all for this adorable Spongebob t-shirt. So, up next is this really super pretty purple tie-dye Spongebob shirt. So, it's this very, very pretty purple tie-dye design right here. And this is actually sort of, I guess, a crop top. Oh my gosh. Because it's a little bit cut right here. And that's very, very super awesome. And it has this really super adorable picture of little Spongebob. I absolutely love that Spongebob face. It's probably one of my favorite Spongebob pictures. <laughs> and it has his name written right here in this very, very pretty font. Spongebob. And then it has the bikini bottom flowers right here too, as you can see. Here, 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 and here. And then there's some like little bubbles right here. And over here too, of course. And, um... The shirt, it was from Kohl's, right here, as you can see, very nice tag, okay. So it's actually pretty much off of this adorable little Spongebob purple tie-dye crop top. I absolutely love how cute little Spongy Bobby is, he's so adorable. Okay, so it's off of this adorable Spongebob purple tie-dye cropped t-shirt. So up next is... These really super funny Spongebob Super 7 figures. So here's this really, really funny, I guess, Spongebob Skull Pants figure. And he honestly looks so scary, terrifying, and like all, all of that stuff. He just looks very, very scary. But I guess he's kind of cool, I guess. <laughs> and... It's very hard to tell, but he has a little splinter in his thumb. Because obviously this little guy, I guess, was based off of the splinter episode. And a lot of people hate that episode because of how bad Spongebob's thumb splinter looks. And I agree, it really is horrifying. But, um... But the Spongebob figure is kind of cool, I guess. Even though he's very, very horrifying, but... Yeah. So yeah, there's... Series 1 of the Super 7 figures, and then Series 2. Alright, and then here's this, uh, I guess Spongegar figure, even though this is really primitive sponge. But, um, yeah, this is really primitive sponge right here, not Spongegar, but a lot, a lot of people love Spongegar. I guess Spongegar, because obviously the Spongegar meme is really hilarious. I mean, you can literally see the meme right here. And the figure itself looks very, very funny. <laughs> looks very funny. And yep. The back. Exactly the same as the creepy, um, skeleton almost Spongebob with Splinter in his thumb. And this one right here is my favorite. I really love this Band Geek Spongebob figure. I just, he's not horrifying at all. I think he's very, very cute. And yeah, it looks like he's singing very, very loud. And it comes with a little microphone accessory, too. You can see that. It looks very, very awesome. And then there's this picture right here. Very, very nice. I love this little guy. And then here is the back as well. 
Alright, so that's all for these really super cool Super 7 figures. This one right here is definitely my favorite. Um, <laughs> these two are very, very odd. But oh well. Um, yeah, so that's all for these Super 7 Spongebob figures. So, <laughs> up next is... These two really super cool Spongebob toys. So, firstly, we have this adorable little... Oh, hold on a second. I mean to move that. Alright. So, here's this really cute Spongebob. Like, world's coolest, I guess, keychain. You can see that it comes with this very, very itty-bitty, like, teeny tiny Spongebob figure. I mean, he's about the size of my pinky nail. He's so tiny. I mean, look at him. Oh, my gosh. Oh, how cute. And he's in, like, a little tiny boat mobile, as you can kind of see there. It's so adorable. And it comes with this very, very nice keychain with this blue sand in it. You can see it moving in there. It looks very, very cool. It almost reminds me of kinetic sand, but it's foam alive. And, yep, it's called Boat and Spongebob. I can't wait to take this out of the box sometime. This looks very, very cool and interesting. And then here's the back of the little box. I like how it's see-through. Kind of see that there. Bunches of information about it. Looks very, very nice. And then, here is this really cool Spongebob Rev Up Chopper set. And I absolutely love this Spongebob Rev Up Chopper set. And I'm not a huge fan of motorcycles in real life, but my mom's brother, or my Uncle Bill, he has a Harley Davidson, and it's very cool. <laughs> so, um... As you can see, um, it comes with this very, very cool, like, purple and red motorcycle. I'm so sorry. It, it fell off the, um, what do you call those again? Uh, zip ties? Whatever the heck you want to call them. Um, but yeah, it's very, very cool. Okay, and then it has this very cool ramp. It's, it's hollow, though, so... It's it's cool though, whatever. And it comes with this really cool like Spongebob Born to be Wild figure. It looks very cool. And this is based off the episode uh, Born to be Wild, I believe. I don't know, it's the one where Spongebob thinks that the wild ones are coming, but they're really the mild ones and they're really elderly guys. Um, <laughs> but yeah, here is this side of the box. It has Spongy's hand right here. And then, then this side has his eye right here and then the bottom has his adorable little leg and this little set was made in 2010 holy mackerel and um <laughs> the top it's pretty basic oh god and the back yeah it's very cool though oh yeah you can kind of see there want to be wild figure and the description very similar to the episode but yeah, it looks very, very cool. And I'm so sorry. This item is just a little bit damaged because, you know, the motorcycle fell up. But, but, but I mean, it's unscathed though. It, it did very, very well. Alright, so it, it, just, it just fell out of the package. Alright, so it's all for this adorable little SpongeBob keychain and this really cool SpongeBob motorcycle set. I can't wait to get these out of the boxes sometime. <laughs> so... Up next is these really super cool SpongeBob books. So right here is this very, very cute, I guess, like spiral book. And it's called Grand Prize Winner. And um, this originally came with this very, very cool, like, I guess, almost like a me reader. But obviously, I don't need that. Um, luckily, I just got the book itself. It looks very, very nice, actually. It's a pretty nice quality little book oh my gosh elmo childhood all right and then my trip to atlantis by spongebob square pants this is a very very cute book it back. um yeah it's a very very interesting little book i really love these illustrations i think spongy looks absolutely precious and cute um yeah it's a very very nice and pretty darn interesting story man look at Poor Plankton. Oh, he's suffering. And then, here is this really neat cinemanga called Spongebob Saves the Day. Yep. There's a spine and the back. Obviously, it has some stickers I have to get rid of. 
and that needs some cleaning. But this is a very, very neat little cinnamango. Oh man, it comes with ripped pants, and I love that episode so much. And we got Best in Show. And as you all know, I got the Pet Show SpongeBob book for Christmas. And I got the, I guess, basis for it called Best in Show. And this is it right here. It's very, very nice, and of course, it does have very similar illustrations to the pet show. I mean, it's pretty obvious, but, you know, <laughs> everything's in black and white here, as you can plainly see. Oh, I love that so much! But, yep, that's all for Best in Show, and that's pretty much all for these four, I guess, little SpongeBob books. So, last but not least... Here is the Spongebob Comics Treasure Chest, and this is very super cool, and I absolutely love Spongebob Comics. It just really stinks that I hardly ever get any, like I hardly, like I don't get Spongebob Comics very often, but it's all good though, of course. I mean, Spongebob Comics are pretty hard to find sometimes, but, um, oops, sorry. But yeah, the front of this adorable little box, I like how it has like a cutout right here so you can see Spongebob's face. Oh no. And it says Treasure Chest, Steven Hillenburg, and it even includes the first ever Spongebob comic made. And then here is this side of the box. It's very, very heavy actually. And um, here's the bottom. And here's this side. You can kind of see the spine of the book. And then the top oh and the back oh my word it's very heavy but I really love it all right so oh come on there you go all right so here is the actual I guess comic book <laughs> I like how funny the front cover picture is you can see a little Spongebob and here's the spine again, in the back. Oh, poor Squidward. <laughs> Alright, so... Eh. Okay. It's a pretty thick book, actually. Oh, gosh, okay. And yeah, I can't wait to review this book sometime. It looks very interesting. Alright. And of course, it has the bonus Spongebob um, reprint first issue comic. But, um, obviously you guys won't be able to fully see that until I obviously review this book. Alright, so that's actually pretty much all that I got for Valentine's Day this year. Um, probably my favorite items are definitely the Spongebob comic treasure chest. I love this band geek Spongebob figure. And I really like, hold on a second. I really like this little Spongebob mini keychain. I think that's adorable. And I really like, I don't know, I like pretty much everything I got. I especially love this rev up chopper. It looks very cool. Woo! Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed my Valentine's Day haul. So yeah, goodbye everybody, have a great day, and peace out. And happy Valentine's Day!